I've been doing this for about 10 years now where I give people permission in my life to speak into it. And uh, some people are really guarded and they don't want to do this. And that's why you got to be careful with who you, who, you, who you allow to speak into your life. But if you do not have various accountability partners, and you know, it could be like your best friend who, uh, who does it a lot for you, but I, I have like five or six that speak into my life in different ways. I check in with them, if not daily, it's weekly, uh, depending on what the goal is. But the only way, I shouldn't say the only way, the best way, like to get to the gym, uh, just, I say this and I get a lot of feedback sometimes, but willpower is for suckers. Uh, it really is. Uh, and I, I go back to uh, food. Uh, if you have a Twinkie in your closet and a Twinkie is a, like a snack cake, if you have a snack cake in your, in your pantry at your house uh, and you're trying not to eat it uh, because you're on a diet, uh, how much effort is that snack cake putting out versus you? That snack cake is just sitting on the shelf where you are having to be on 24 hours a day, seven days a week to not eat that snack cake. Who's gonna win? And so uh, accountability partners, like how are you accountable in this life is the discipline, and don't get me wrong, self-discipline, you should be self-disciplined. But if that's all you're relying on, you're going to lose. You have to speak it into existence. I want to go from LA to Phoenix. And I need people to help me get there. 